ಸದಾಶಿವಸಮಾರಂಭಾ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಮಧ್ಯಮಾಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಂ ಶ್ರುತಿಶ್ರುತಿಪುರಾಣಾಲಯ ನಮಿ ಭಗವತ್ಪಾದ ಶಂಕರ ಲೋಕಶಂಕರ ಶಂಕರ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಕೇಶವಂಬಾದರಾಯಣ ಸೂತ್ರಭಾಷ್ಯಕೃತ ವಂದೇ ಭಗವಂತ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಈಶ್ವರೋ ಗುರುರಾತ್ಮೇತಿ ಮೂರ್ತಿ ಭೇದ ವಿಭಾಗಿನೆ ವ್ಯೋಮವ್ಯಾಪ್ತೇಹಾ ದಕ್ಷಿಣಾಮೂರ್ತ ನಮಃ ಸಹನಾವತು ಸಹನೌಘ್ನಕ್ಷ ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕರವಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿ ಅವಧೀತ ಸ್ತುಮಾವಿಶಾವಹೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತ ಶಾಂತ ಶಾಂತಿ ಓಂ ಸಹನಾವತು ಸಹನೌಘ್ನಕ್ಷ ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕರವಾವಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿ ಅವಧೀತ ಸ್ತುಮಾವಿಶಾವಹೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತ ಶಾಂತ ಶಾಂತಿ ಧಾತು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೈವ ಸಂಪ್ರೋಕ್ತ ಜೀವ ಆಖ್ಯಾತ ಮುಚ್ಚದೆ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ಕೃಷಭಂತಾಧಾತು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾತ್ಮನೇ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪರೋ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ದಂಡನೋ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ಸಂಭವಂ ಅಂಡಸ್ಯಾತಸ್ಮೇ ಲೋಕಾ ಸಪ್ತೀಪಾಚು ಸೊ ವಿ ವೇರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಆಟ್ ದಿ ಫೋರ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ವಾಸ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಥರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ So we saw the 14th shloka which said Yaha karmani maam na limpanti karma phale chas mes pruha nasti iti maam abhi janati So Bhagawan is saying one who knows me so Who is that me? Ishwara And Paramatma is known to have no sambandha with karma karma phala ityadi So there is no craving, he does not have any spruha Karma phale spruha nasti me mama and karmani maam na limpanti iti maam abhi janati first he says one who knows me so one who knows krishna meaning ishwara as having no sambandha with karma phala no craving unto karma phala and has no binding with karma so the karmas do not taint him so there is no binding or they do not taint him karmani maam na limpanti so karmas are personified as those which cannot taint Bhagawan. But we saw that this idea here by saying Maam Abhijanati, one who knows me as that kind of a Shuddha Paramatma, who is never affected, who, ha- who is not a Karta or Bhokta. So what this means is Karma Phale Spruha Nasti, so Karma do- does not bind. So Karma, spale, uh, karma Phale Spruha Mama Nasti means Bhagawan does not have craving unto karma phala, thereby he is not a karta, otherwise this will drive him to become a karta and karmani maam na limpanti means he is not a bhokta. So, one who knows paramatma, ishwara as a karta, a bhokta, saha karma bina vadyate, how is that possible? And in that context, we saw that this is indicating, this is hinting at the Mahavakya, where, whereby this jnana, that paramatma is not affected is not a karta or a bhokta, thereby I or a person who knows that if he is freed, karma bhi na badhyate, even while doing the karma, he is still not bound. Why? Because this knowledge many may have, many may think that Ishwara has, he blesses us with everything, but he himself has nothing to do with karma or bhoga, karma phala, but still how does that knowledge free a person? It is only possible if you are that Paramatma. Otherwise it is not possible. So Anyatha Anupapatti, Arthapatti is indicated here and that is made clear in the next shloka whereby Bhagavan Bhashyakara says Naham Karta Name Karma Phale Spruha Aham Karta Na and Mama Me Mama Karma Phale Spruha Nasti Iti Iti what? Iti. This is the idea which is expressed about Bhagawan in the 14th shloka and this idea we have seen in the last shloka that the last patha that it is applicable to an individual as well. Jeeva also because Jeeva Brahma even aparaha. Na aparaha. Brahma, Jeeva is Brahma, not anyone else, not something which is lower, one who is lower in caliber than Bhagawan. It is not an individual. Jiva is not an individual at all. There is no individuality at all. In reality, there is no individuality. That is Ajnana Krita. This idea is seen here. Naham Karta Name Karma Phais Pruha Iti Evam Nyatva Kritam Karma Purvairapi Mumukshubihi 
Kurukarma eva tasmatvam purvai kurvataram kritam. This idea about Paramatma is applicable to Jiva also. Thereby he says evam nyatva. Evam is itti evam nyatva. Evam nyatva if you put to, with the earlier shloka. <coughs> see. Namam karmani limpanti name karma phales pruha iti maam yu abhijanati. And that maam has to be you. It cannot be Paramatma alone. Otherwise, evam nyatva krutam karma purvai rapi mumukshu bhi. Mumukshu, by earlier mumukshu is also purvai hi mumukshu bhi hi. By the earlier mumukshu is also. Since in, across all yugas, purvai hi api mumukshu bhi hi karma krutam. Karma has been done. So you also Arjuna do the karma, but how evam nyatva? Knowing that Bhagavan is not bound, you do karma, how does that make sense? Bhagavan is not bound, you do karma. Makes no sense unless you see that naham karta name karma phales pruha iti evam nyatva. Not maam na limpati, uh, maam karmani, karmani na limpati. This is what Bhagavan is saying. If you take maam as applicable to Bhagavan, paramatmanam, na limpati, then this sloka will make absolutely no sense. This Here also you may need some arthapatti. But if even if you miss this, saha karma bhi na badyate, you can say possible, Bhagavan is saying, but evam nyatva krutam karma purvai rapi mukshu bhi. Purvai rapi mukshu karma kim artham krutam. Why did they do karma if Bhagavan is not bound? Absolutely no sense is, can be made unless Paramatma is Jivatma. This idea is very clear here, even in Gita, across shlokas you can see how the meaning is hidden. Therefore, Tasmat Tvam Karma Kuru. Why? Bhagavan is not going to be bound, you do the karma. Does it make sense to anyone? So, anyone who has a little common sense, we can see that Tvam Karma Kuru, Paramatmanam Nalimpati means karma, karmani Tvamapi Nalimpanti. Tamapi nalimpanti, they will not even affect you because you are Paramatma. This is the idea here. Purvaihi Purvataram Krutam. Purvaihi Purvataram means Tarak Pratya is added. So even earlier, earlier, earlier than. So Purvaihi Purvaihi Krutam. Purvaihi api Mumukshubhi Krutam and Purvaihi Purvataram Krutam, even earlier to that also. So whatever earlier you, you are thinking by those earlier in this yuga itself, even before them. So Purvataram is a comparative degree. So Purvataram api Krutam. What? Which, what Purvataram Krutam Karma? Tomapi Kuru. So whatever karma they did, Kshatriya, so for, for um, Arjuna, the example is of Kshatriyas where Janaka Ityadi were mentioned in passing. So, Purvai Rapi Purvataram Kritam Karma Tvamapi Kuru. You also do the same karma that they did. So, what is that same karma? If you have Jnana, do it for Loka Sangraha. If you do not have Jnana, do it for Chitta Shuddhi. But do the karma, do not give up the karma. This is the idea here. And through this, whatever is uh, hidden between the lines in 14th and 15th shloka, that is said clearly by the Bhashyakara, Naham karta name karma plus phales pruvaiti evam nyatva. And this also tells us another thing. The way to study Gita, whenever we chant Gita, if the meaning occurs to us, well and good, over a period of time, the meaning will start revealing itself because uh, if we study and keep on revisiting the meaning, not only uh, the uh, Sanskrit meaning, but this hidden meaning will also come forth because Naham Karta Name Karma Phales Pruha, this idea can easily be seen if you study the Gita, chant or read the Gita from, not from Arjuna's perspective. If you consider yourself as Arjuna and whenever Arjuna asks a question, uh, you see as it is your question and you see the answer by Bhagwan as answer by Bhagwan then that will not give you as much fruit as as much phala or as much mileage as much as if you read the Gita from the perspective of Bhagwan. So the Aham Bhava should be with Bhagwan, not with Arjuna. It is okay to have it with Arjuna. 
for a uh, good period of time so that our doubts are cleared. But once you understand this Naham Karta Name Karma Phales Pruha as the perspective of Bhagavan as your own perspective, then you will see that Evam Nyatva Krutam Karma Purve Rupi Mumukshubhi Kuru Karma Tasmatvam Purve Purvataram Krutam Purve Purvataram Krutam This idea becomes clear that how I won't be bound if I don't have Kartrutu and Bhuktrutu Bhava just like Bhagavan what is natural to Bhagavan has to come with an effort from my side. So I have to put in an effort to understand Sravana Manana Nididhyasana and through that effort once I know I have a clear clarity that I am not a Karta, I am not a Bhokta, then the Karma whatever I am doing cannot bind me. This is the idea shown here. So Evam in this manner and Evam if you take it with the earlier Shloka, Evam means that Bhagavan is not bound, but that idea will not fit in well. Therefore, evam has to be naham karta name karma phales pruha. There has to be an anurti for myself also. Evam nyatva having known this. So, evam is evam in this manner. This is a sense of karma for nyatva. Evam nyatva kritam karma purve mumukshubhi kritam karma. So, kritam is prathama vibhakti. Karma Purvaihi Kritiya Bhau Vachana Pullinga Api Mumukshubihi by Mumukshus. Therefore, Tama Bhi Kuru. So, Kuru is Lot Lakara Madhya Purusha Ek Vachana Karma Kuru. So, Tama Bhi Karma Kuru. Karma is second case. Karma to Krudhatu Bhikrunj Karne in Kuru. Tasmat Tasmat Karana Tama Bhi Karta is Tom Purvaihi. Purva Taram Krutam Karma Kuru. So this becomes Karma. In Samana Dekas Karma. Purva Taram Krutam Karma Toma Pi Kuru. Toma Pi Kuru. Why? Tasma. Since you are not a Karta, you are not a Bhukta. That is the idea here. Evam Nyatva Nyatva Karma Purvahi Api Mumukshubihi <coughs> Sorry Purvahi Api Mumukshubihi Krutam Karma What we can do here? Purvaihi Iti. So, evam nyatva or evam. What we can do is Purvaihi evam Purvaihi api mumukshubi kritam karma. Iti nyatva also you can say. So you can say evam purvai api mumukshubhi evam nyatva. So it's okay. evam nyatva purvai api mumukshubhi karma kritam. Kritam karma kritam. Karma kritam. So this makes, this is the idea. So I'll put it in uh, brackets. Evam nyatva. Evam nyatva means you, why should you do this, do karma? Purvairapi Mumukshubihi Karma Krutam. Karma was done by Mumukshus earlier also. How? Evam Nyatva. And Evam is shown here. Naham Karta Name Karme Karma Phales Pruha Iti. Iti Evam Nyatva. So this whole idea can go in, in brackets here. So it was known by them. Iti evam nyatva purvaihi api mumukshubi karma kritam. This is onanvaya. And tasma, therefore, si purvai api mumukshubi karma kritam, what did they, they, they knew? What did they know? They knew that. 
Yeah. So they knew that karma will not bind me. Karma phale me spruhanasti naham karta. So when they knew this, then karma stopped to bind them because if they are not karta, they cannot remain as bhokta. Sankhyas think that atma is bhokta, not a karta, but that is a misunderstanding. You cannot have bhoga. On what basis will you become a bhokta if you are not if you have not uh, done any karma? So entire theory of karma, the entire vyavastha of karma and karma phala falls apart if you take Sankhya's view. Sankhya is not Sankhya in the sense of the second chapter Sankhya. Sankhyas have two meanings. Sankhya is a darshana also. So Sankhya darshana which goes hand in hand with yoga. They are dvaitins. But this Sankhya in the second chapter is uh, those who have knowledge that Atma is neither karta nor bhokta. Na hanyate hanyamane sharire and finally advaita tattva. That is the Sankhya here in the second chapter. But Sankhya darshana thinks that uh, Atma has bhoga. So Atma is bhokta not a karta. That is incorrect because there will be no basis on which karma will go to, particular karma phala will go to atma. Anyway, so that's an aside. Evam jnata purvayapi mumukshubi karma krutam. Therefore, they knew that I am not a karta and thereby they did not remain bhokta and thereby they are freed. Tasmat, simil, tasmat karana and since they did it, knowing this, you also do the karma knowing this very idea. So, karma won't bind you. This is the idea here, tasmat tvam purvaihi tvam purvaihi purva taram krutam karma kuru. Eva is remaining. So, tasmadeva you can say, tasmadeva, tasmadeva tvam purvaihi purva taram Kritam karma kuru. So the very karma that they did, you also do. Tatra karma chet kartavyam. If karma should be done, it has to be done. Tvadvachana deva karomi aham. So Arjuna may be thinking that Tvadvachana, Tvadvachana is Krishna vachana. Krishna has told me you do this karma. Why are you telling me purvai krutam karma? Therefore you do it. Tasma, they did it, so you also do it. You just tell me to do and I will do. This because he has samarpana bhava now, more or less. So he has samarpana bhava. Then Arjuna may be thinking, why are you telling me you do the karma because your purvajas have done? You can just tell me do the karma. You don't have to tell me why or whatever. You just tell me. Do it. So, tatra karma chet kartavyam tadvachana deva karomi aham kim visheshitena purvai hi purvataram kritam ityuchyate. Why did he specifically say that others have also done it? See, the idea here is if others have done it, he is showing that others were free earlier and thereby this jnana is not something which is new. It has always been there. Whatever I have taught in the second and third chapter, yoga, which I have taught, which I, he has already expressed that idea which he had taught to Surya Bhagavan also and it has, it has, it has, it has always been there. For that sake, he is talking about these uh, earlier people who have gone by across the world and his Purvajas also. But he is also indicating that uh, this knowledge, yoga is available to everyone and everyone can get the Purusharata Siddhi, Moksha by following this. That is also an idea which is shown. So, kim visheshitere purvahi purvataram krutam iti uchyate. Why this visheshana has been given? Purvahi purvataram krutam yasmat mahad vaishamyam karmani. Another reason it has been said, why karma should be done and purvahi purvataram krutam karma, the way they, they did it. So, all this idea is included in purvahi purvataram krutam means you learn from the sampradaya, you learn from the tradition as to with what understanding they did the karma? With what understanding did they deliver their duties? This you have to learn from the tradition. You cannot just do uh, as per your wishes. So that is another idea. Why? Yasma. Since? Because. Because Mahad Vaishamyam. Karmani. Karmani. Karmani Vishaye. Vishaye Saptami here. Karmani Vishaye Mahad Vaishamyam Asti. There is a lot of contradictory understanding. 
with respect to karma that i am a, i am not a karta i am bhokta i am only a karta i am not bhokta i am karta as well as bhokta all these misunderstandings are there and what is karma what should be done what is not karma a karma all this there is there is contradiction there are contradictory ideas and great contradiction is there. great as in there is a vast variety there are various darshanas if starting from charvaka darshana ending with buddhist jainis jainism also they have various ideas of karma and atma also by extension but karmani vishaye mahad vaishamyam bhavati yasmat tasmat purvehi purvataram krutam iti uchyate therefore you have to learn from the tradition and that is answered now uh, having answered this purvehi purvataram krutam why it is said you have to learn from the sampradaya proper as to what is karma what should be done what should not be done so dharma kar, karma has meaning of dharma vedika dharma what should be done what should not be done there are lot of varieties available misunderstandings are there katham how is it katham vaishamyam katham means what uh, mahad vaishamyam katham bhavati karmani vishaye why is there so much of issue or so much uh, confusion with relation with respect to karma that is answered in the 16th shloka by saying कर्तव्य सो किम कर्म कर्तव्य कर्म किम भवति एंड अकर्म अकर्तव्य न कर्तव्य कर्म किम भवति कवय कवय आर कवय आर क्रांतदर्शी क्रांतदर्शी वेर दी सी कवीज दे से दैट इवन व्हेन दिस वेर द सूर्य किरण डज नॉट रीच देयर कवीज कैन रीच कवीज द सिंपल ट्रांसलेशन इज पोएट it is not the meaning here krantadarshi those who can see beyond a limited intellect of human beings they are kind of like rishis rishis are kavis so munis rishi munis are called as kavis here so kavaya api even those rishis who wrote other darshanas other darshanas have been written by rishis they were krantadarshis but they also were deluded so they were uh, the darshanas which have are vaidika darshanas they were also vaidikas but they were deluded api atra atra means asmin vishaye asmin vishaye means karmani vishaye atra kavayah api mohitah mohita means mudha deluded mudha mohita has has the same meaning uh, so mohadhatu mohadhatu says that there is a delusion mohadhatu uh, and ta pratyah so pratyav is idagama so you get mohitaha moh becomes there is a guna here moh moh becomes moh and ita ta pratyav will bring in idagama in this case and mohita mohitaha so mohitaha they are also deluded even the rishis kavis are deluded in the matter of karma as to they also do not know which is karma which is akarma and we have seen vishwamitra rishi what should not be done he did it later he he got out of that but he was trapped for a good while in indra's trap because what should be done kartavyam karma he also got deluded i'm just giving an example may not be a right example but still to drive home, home a point that darshana rishis or other rishis may be deluded at some point of time they may be deluded and that is the reason we have to learn from the tradition as to and not logically not you know i think it is right not as per one's emotions or not as per one's likes and dislikes but through the tradition not through logic as it as i think uh, you know science says this therefore it does not matter what i do so all these ideas should be kept aside you should not entertain and you should learn from the tradition as to what is karma what is a karma tatte karma pravakshami pravakshami rut lakara aham pravakshami i will prakarshena vakshami i'll tell you very well means i'll teach you te te tava 
और तुभ्यम कर्म प्रवक्षा में आई विल टेल यू वॉट इज दैट कर्म I'll narrate and to you very well. I'll elaborate, ex- expose this idea of what is karma, what is akarma. Tat is what kim karma, kim akarma. Tat, tat te karma pravakshami. I will tell you which is karma. And karma here includes akarma also, because kim karma, kim akarma, iti, iti, uh, iti pravakshami. So this karma means this idea, kim karma, kim akarma. That I'll tell you. So this karma can be expanded from the फर्स्ट पाद यज्ञ मीन्स तत्ते प्रवक्षा आई विल टेल यू दैट अबाउट विच इवन दी कवीज आर डिल्यूडेड एंड हैविंग नोन विच यज्ञा सो यद इज कर्म टू ज्ञावा यज्ञा तम अशुभात मोक्ष से यू विल मोक्ष से ऑल्सो रट लकारा यू विल बी फ्रीड फ्रॉम अशुभ अशुभ मीन्स पापा because kim karma once you know kartavyam karma you will be prodded to do that and kim akarma once you know that it should na kartavyam then you will withdraw from that so there will be pravritti towards karma there will be nivritti from akarma thereby nivritti from akarma will give you freedom from ashubha papa therefore moksha se ashubhat tvam moksha se so kim karma bhavati ऑल न्यूटन किम अकर्म भवति एंड प्रथम एक वचन इति विषय कवय इन प्लूरल कवि प्लूरल ऑफ कवि इज कवय कपी अत्र अत्र अस्मिन विषय सप्तमी सप्तमी अर्थित्रल मोहिता प्लूरल कवय मोहिता भवति तत्ते कर्म अहम प्रवक्षा जो तत्ते द्वितीय तेज तुभ्यम तत्कर्म अहम प्रवक्षा लटलकारा ये ज्ञावा ज्ञावा कर्म टू ज्ञावा देर फोर सेकेंड केस ये ज्ञावा मोक्ष से मध्य पुरुष एक वचना लटलकारा अशुभात मोक्ष से सो किम सो वी कैन पुट दिस इन कोटेशन किम कर्म किम कर्म इति इति कवय इति कवय अभी मोहिता एज इट इज इति इत्यत्र सो यू कैन सी इति अत्र कवय अभी मोहिता मोहिता भवन्ति और मोहिता सन्ति और मोहिता इट्स टेल्स यू दैट इट्स इट्स इन सामान कवय सो यू डोंट नीड एनीथिंग एल्स इट्स रिप्लेसमेंट फॉर वर्क हियर तत् तत्कर्म तत्कर्म अहम अहम तत्कर्म ते तुभ्यम प्रवक्षा देन यज और वी कैन से यज्ञावा वी कैन ब्रिंग दी यिफोर य यज्ञावा और यू कैन ब्रिंग कर्म ऑल्सो हेर यम ज्ञावा तम अशुभा मोक्ष से तत्कर्म सो यम ज्ञावा तम अशुभा विमोक्ष से तत्कर्म अहम ते प्रवक्षा आई टेल दैट वेरी कर्म टू यू नोइंग विच यू विल बी फ्रीड फ्रॉम अशुभ सो दिस इज दि अन्वया हियर न चेत त्वया मंतव्यम सो मंतव्य मीन्स शुड बी कन्सिडर्ड न मंतव्य मीन्स शुड नॉट बी थॉट शुड नॉट बी कन्सिडर्ड एत एंड च एंड त्वया एत न मंतव्यम by you this idea should not be entertained what is that idea karma nama what is there to be taught you are saying kavaya api atra mohitah i don't think so what is karma even i know you are telling me so this this idea will be there for many you know what is karma what is there to know in karma and are you saying that rishis were deluded even i know what is karma so this idea should not be entertained karma nama what is karma karma means 
देहादी चेष्टा देहादी चेष्टा इज कर्म लोक प्रसिद्ध सो वॉट इज वेल नोन इन दी वर्ल्ड हाउ कैन इवन ऋषीज बी कन्फ्यूज अबाउट दैट आई नो इट एंड वॉट इज दैट कर्म नाम कर्म मीन्स वॉट कर्म नाम कर्म मीन्स देहादी चेष्टा चेष्टा मीन्स गति ही ऑल दी इंटेलिजेंसिस एनी मूवमेंट देहादी मूवमेंट दी मूवमेंट ऑफ दी देहा the indulgence of the deha or any activity of the deha deha the done by the body mind sense complex is karma i know this any bodily movement any movement of the mind any uh, recall from smriti any uh, thinking any day dreaming all of this is what it is just uh, movement of all of this is just karma is karma nothing else is there to be known so karma nama deha di chesta लोक प्रसिद्ध इट इज वेल नोन इन दी वर्ल्ड एंड वॉट इज अकर्म अकर्म नाम तदक्रिया तदक्रिया इज अक्रियाम चेष्टा नाम अक्रिया इज अकर्म सो अकर्म इज वेरी क्लियर कर्म इज क्लियर सो नॉट डूइंग दैट इज अकर्म सो अक्रिया यू सी दिस अक्रिया इज सेम एज दिस ऑपोजिट टू दिस चेष्टा सो चेष्टा इज क्रिया हियर Dehadi kriya is karma and dehadi akriya is a karma. It is very simple. This kind of a thinking, na je eta tvaya mantavyam, kim tatra bodhavyam. And then finally, once you have already pre-concluded that I know what is karma, what is a karma, then kim tatra bodhavyam means kim tasmin vishaye kim bodhavyam bhavati, kim apni bodhavyam nasti. There is nothing to be known there. It is clear as daylight to me. Iti na mantavyam. Kasmat. Why? Why is it so? Kasmat karanat. Kasmat means what? Kasmat karanat. Iti. This idea. What has been said here in highlight. This. This idea. Kasmat na mantavyam. Why should it not be thought so or concluded so? Uchyate. That is being answered in the next shloka. कर्मण बोधव्य बोधव्य विकर्मण अकर्मणश्च बोधव्य गहना कर्मणो गति इट इज नॉट दैट यू नो कर्म आई मीन भगवान इज एज दो एंसरिंग अर्जुन थिंकिंग दैट आई आई नो इट हाउ कैन रिश इज बी डिल्यूडेड अर्जुन और एनी वन हु इज स्टडिंग द गीता फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम मे थिंक दैट आई ऑलरेडी नो कर्म वाई इट्स इट नॉट सो and why is it that rishis were deluded that is answered here karmano karmana hi api bodhavyam bodhavyam cha vikarmana ha akarmanascha bodhavyam it should be known kin tatra bodhavyam tasmin vishaye kim bodhavyam karmani vishaye kim api bodhavyam nasti if you think that no karmana hi api bodhavyam one should know what is what are karmas कर्मण ही अभी बोधव्य कर्मण कर्मण विषय सो विल सी भाष्य हियर आई जस्ट मेन्शन दिस कर्मण कर्म ही इंडीड इंडीड कर्मण बोधव्य एंड विकर्मण अभी बोधव्य अकर्मण से बोध्य सो कर्म अकर्म हेज बीन मेन्शन नव विकर्म हेज ऑल्सो बीन मेन्शन वॉट आर दीज एंड विल सी दिस इन भाष्य गहना कर्मण गति ही वाय कारण इज गिवन दिस इज द कारण चतुर्थ पद हेज दि हेतु हियर वॉट इज दि हेतु कर्मण कर्मण गति गति ऑफ कर्म दिस षष्टी कर्मण गति गति स्त्रीलिंग तिनंता गहना बहुती देर फॉर गहना गति स्त्रीलिंग देर फॉर गहना गहना मीन्स इट इज इट्स अ सीक्रेट इट इज वेरी डीप केप सीक्रेट सो कर्मण गति हाउ दिस कर्म वर्क रियली वर्क is difficult to know it is not in fact it is next to impossible we can we have just broad strokes we have some broad ideas from shastras as to what happens how uh, a person takes another janma how this karma acts on the person how karma phala is uh, you know you cannot run away from karma phala we have some ideas at a very uh, kind of a birds eye view or a very superficial level but that is the that is the depth you can go and some shastras tell you as to what is punya what is papa what should not be done what should all that is fine but how this karma attaches uh, to a person how it will affect which karma will uh, lead to which birth all these ideas 
are not very clear unless a lot of study is done even then the, it is only thus far the knowledge is only thus far it is not clear completely thereby what happens karma understanding of karma is also limited karma what should be done what should not be done because we don't know how the result will be unless we have studied shastras a lot therefore gahana karma na gati so 17 shloka here bhashya what is this karma karmanah shastra bhitasya what is karmanah karmanah api karmanah shastra bhitasya is the meaning of karma here karmana shastra shasti ek vachana shastra bhitasya karmanah hi yasmat api asti bodhavyam so he say yasmat he takes here yasmat i said eva but bodhavyam बोधव्यम अस्ति बोधव्यम च अस्ति एव विकर्मण व्हाट इज विकर्मण प्रतिहिद्दस्य सो दिस कर्म इज शास्त्रविहित व्हिच इज प्रिस्क्राइब इंजंक्शन देयर इज अ इंजंक्शन ऑफ कर्म व्हाट व्हाट शुड बी डन एंड विकर्म इज व्हाट प्रतिहिद्द व्हाट शुड नॉट बी डन सो शास्त्र टॉक्स अबाउट प्रिस्क्रिप्शंस एंड प्रोहिबिशंस व्हाट शुड बी डन व्हाट शुड नॉट बी डन व्हाट सो प्रिस्क्राइब कर्म विल गिव यू पुण्य so karma will give you punya and vikarma will give you papa what about akarma tatha akarmanas what is not karma here he says akarmanas cha tushnim bhavasya bodhavyam so you have to understand akarma also as to what is not karma is just sitting idle doing nothing akarma or not that also should be understood and uh, next shloka will tell you how difficult it is next shloka I, i just expanded just see how much how much uh, bhashya is there on this so there there is two three pages of bhashya on uh, in a small printed book you will run into two three pages or at least in a uh, uh, good size book it's a it's a good one page uh, tika or bhashya on this not tika bhashya itself is around a good uh, one page and we see that shloka so here he says karma is शास्त्र बोधव्यम कर्मण कर्मण बोधव्यमस्त एंड विकर्मण अभी बोधव्यमस्त एंड अकर्मण अभी बोधव्यमस्त वॉट इज कर्म विहित कर्म वॉट इज वॉट इज प्रतिषिद्ध प्रतिषिद्ध एंड वॉट इज अकर्म मीन्स नॉट अकर्म इज जस्ट सिटिंग आइडल अकर्म और नॉट दैट ऑल्सो हेज टू बी इन्क्वाइर्ड इन टू एंड हेज टू बी लर्न why because karmana gati hi gahana bhavati so here karmana hi asmat api bodhavyam and bodhavyam cha vikarmana akarmana cha bodhavyam asti karmana gati hi गहना भवती so, सुकर्मण गति ही गहना भवती सो वी कैन से यस्मात कर्मण ही गति सो यस्मात मीनिंग इज ब्रॉट इन इफ यू ओनली इफ यू कनेक्ट विथ सी एव कारा ही इज एव कारा इफ यू कनेक्ट विथ कर्मण कर्मण एव बोधव्यम अस्त बट ही इज टेकन एज यस्मा सो इट इज गो वेल विथ कर्मण ही यस्मा कर्मण गति गहना भवती तस्मा सो यू कैन एट तथा सो ही इज यस्मा हियर यस्मा सो तथा आई थिंक दिस मेक्स अ बेटर अन्वय सो आई जस्ट पुट इट इफ यू हैव अ डिफरेंट वे दैट इज ऑल्सो ओके तथा कर्मण बोधव्यम बोधव्यम अस्ति इज नॉट नीडेड हियर कृत्या इज देर बट देन विकर्मण इट कैन बी अंडरस्टूड विकर्मण च बोधव्यम अस्ति यू हैव टू सप्लाय एंड और वी कैन से बोधव्यम एंड व्हाट एल्स इज देर अकर्मण बोधव्यम 
if you have to supply asti, in the end you can just add asti. So, tasmad karmana bi bodhavyam, vikarmanascha bodhavyam, akarmanascha bodhavyam asti. Kim punaha tattvam karmadehe? Kim punaha karmadehe tattvam asti? What is the reality of karma? Yat bodhavyam vakshami iti pratidnyatam. What has been said? Where has he said? He has said pravakshami. So pravakshami means I will tell you. Means Bhagavan has assured that I will teach you. Don't worry Arjuna, I will teach you. And through Arjuna as Nimitta, he is going to teach the entire set of students who are studying Gita as to what is karma, what is vikarma, what is akarma. And now one Bhashyakara is inquiring into this. Kim punaha karma dehe tattvam. Karma dehe tattvam means karma dhi, tattva of karma dhi. Karma, vikarma and akarma. This is included with karma dehe. Karma dhi. Shashti of karma dhi is karma dehe. And karma dhi is what? Karma, vikarma, akarma. Yat bodhavyam vakshami means pravakshami iti pratidhyatam. Which is, which has been sworn by Bhagavan or promised by Bhagavan as I will teach you. Ucchyate. What is the tattva? Here goes, he says, in 18th shloka, karmanya karmaya pashyed, akarmani cha karmaya ha, sabudhiman manusheshu, sayukta krishna karma krita. So very confusing. Karmani akarma ya pashyed, one who sees, ya ha pashyed, one who sees. What? What does one see? Sees means understands. Janati ityartha. One who sees karmani akarma. One who sees akarma. Non-karma in karma. In karma one sees akarma. And yaha cha akarmani karma pashyed. One who sees akarma in so karma in akarma and akarma in karma. First he says akarma in karma. One who sees, one who knows. So one who sees a karma in karma means what? One who knows in karma there is no no karma. So in karma one who sees no karma and one who sees karma in a karma. Saha buddhiman. Manushyeshu saha buddhiman bhavati. In human beings he is buddhiman. Matupanta buddhimat buddhi asyasthiti buddhiman. Everyone has buddhi. But he has prakrishta buddhi. He has a very refined buddhi. He can see subtle things. He can understand subtle things. He is a jnani ityartha. Viveki and finally tending to jnani. Because he knows what people consider as karma, there is no karma there. And what people consider as akarma, there is karma. We will see the meaning there. The bhashya is very long but I will explain what is the, uh, the idea there. Saha yuktaha krishna karma kut. So he is what? He is sa yuktaha. Yukta means he is a yogi. He is a yogi. He has a composed mind. And Krishna karma. Krishna means entire. Means karma krit. Krishna karma kritam yena saha. Not kritam yena. Krishna karma karmanaha krit. So he is karta. Karta is yata. This is kibanta. So Krishna karma krit. So it is a like an upapada tat purusha. So, Krishna karma karoti. He does everything. Meaning what he has, he is krita kritya ityartha. Krishna karma krita means he has done everything that has to be done. He is that kind of a person. Meaning what he is krita kritya, he is a jnani. He has nothing else to be done. Why? Because when he is doing also, he is an akarta and therefore an abhokta also. How so? We will see this. We will make an anvaya and then understand this. Karmani, Saptami, Akarma, Yah Pashyet. So, Yah is Karta. So, Akarma is Karma to, Karma means an object to this Pashyet. Yah Pashyet, one who sees Vidhiling. Yah Pashyet, Akarmani cha, in Akarma, in non-doing, he sees Karma. Karma ha, Yah Pashyet, Saha, Buddhiman. So, Pashyet will have Anurutti. In the second half also, Manusheshu Saha Buddhiman Bhavati Sa Yuktaha Krishna Karma Krit Api Bhavati. So Karmani 
अकर्म एज इट इज यह पश्चेत और यह कैन गो अर्लियर यह कर्मणि सप्तमी कैन इज बेटर टू गो इन द बिगिनिंग अकर्मणि कर्मणि अकर्म यह पश्चेत एज इट इज यह च कर्म अकर्मणि कर्म पश्चेत सह मनुष्यु बुद्धिमान बुद्धिमान सहयुक्त और यू कैन से सहयुक्त दैट योगी मनुष्यु बुद्धिमान कृष्ण और सह बुद्धिमान सह बुद्धिमान युक्त मनुष्यु कृष्ण कर्म कृत भवती so what is the idea here the idea is generally what is the idea up you say that i am going to this place i am watching a movie i am uh, studying so i am singing all these ideas are what i am doing i am doing so there with what is the idea i am thinking this don't disturb me i am thinking all these ideas are with all the sense organs i become a karta there is a tadatmya sambandha with the sharira body mind sense complex the body is doing the activity the mind is thinking but we have we have tadatmya sambandha with that and although i know that i have the body it is my body the body is not me it is my mind it is my buddhi my ego but still there is tadatmya sambandha when i say that i am fat i am thin i am tall i when i say i am thinking i don't say there is thinking going on or i don't say that i can watch i can see thinking is going on i can see the emotions in my mind but i say i am happy i don't say the happiness is born in the mind but i say i am happy so there is a tadatmya sambandha tadatmya sambandha is identification which is adhyasika it is a superimposition mutual superimposition is there between atma and anatma so with respect to that when i say karmani अकर्म यह पश्चेत वन हु नोज अ विवेक ही नोज दैट देर इज नो कर्म आई एम आत्मा एंड आत्मा हैज नो संबंध आत्मा इज शुद्ध इट इज असंग सो असंग आत्मा हाउ कैन इट बी हैप्पी और सैड हाउ कैन इट बी थिंकिंग हाउ कैन इट बी वॉकिंग सिंगिंग ईटिंग डांसिंग वॉट एवर इट इज देर के नॉट बी एनी एक्टिविटी फॉर दिस आत्मा विच इज मी एंड देर बाय अकर्म यह पश्चेत कर्मणि और सर्वेशु कर्मसु इन ऑल कर्म इन ऑल कर्म वन सीज अ कर्म दैट पर्सन इज अ विवेकी नाउ द अदर वे अराउंड व्हेन व्हाट द वर्ल्ड थिंक्स इज दैट व्हाट आर यू डूइंग आई एम फेड अप विद ऑल एक्टिविटीज आई जस्ट वांट टू रेस्ट सो व्हेन यू से यू वांट टू रेस्ट मीनिंग व्हाट आई एम जस्ट आफ्टर स्पेशली आफ्टर एग्जाम्स यू नो आफ्टर आवर एग्जाम्स यू शुड से द एंटायर डे आई एम गोइंग टू स्लीप आफ्टर द एग्जाम्स बिकॉज़ यू आर Uh, slogged it out for so long your night outs for studies after that what do you do i am tired as soon as my last exam is over i am going to sleep through the day you come back home you eat and just sleep like a log so what is the idea there i am going to withdraw from all activities i am not going to play i am not going to do anything else no study is nothing so no mental activity no physical activity all that was seen as karma i am withdrawing means i am not going to act actually what is happening the body is not going to act and when you say i am not going to act you think it is a karma but what is the real idea there there is karma there by saying that i am going to withdraw when you think that you can withdraw from karma that withdrawal itself is a karma so a karma ni in that a karma of not i am just going to do nothing when you say when i am doing nothing that is a karma but there wo viveki yah viveki sah karma pashye yah karma pashye he sees karma there because the person has identification with not doing he has identification with withdrawal and this is true even of a sanyasi who may think that i will become a karta 
Atma will become a karta if one thinks that and therefore I should take sannyasa. That is also wrong. So this is another an idea which is given in another tika. It's a difficult verse otherwise. Uh, uh, there is a lot of discussion under this verse. If you are interested, we can look into it or maybe some other time. Let me know if you are interested. We can look at parts or the entire bhashya also. I don't mind that. But uh, if you understand this, this is the idea here. Yaha karmani as in the karma of body mind sense complex with respect to those karmas one sees a karma because atma is not associated and at the same time when someone says that I am going to withdraw from all activity there he sees karma because in that withdrawal a karma it is not really a karma it is karma because he has kartrutva bhava and he is withdrawing that withdrawal is also karma there when one sees a karma yaha pashye saha manushyeshu buddhiman bhavati he is the one who real has viveka buddhi therefore buddhiman Others have buddhi, but they are not using that buddhi. They are going with the loka prasiddha artha. They think that I am karta, I am bhokta, I belong to this family, I am in this varnashrama, I am a son of this, I am a daughter, so I have a gender, and then all the activities follow. So there is um, there is an association with body mind sense complex. Thereby they do not have viveka buddhi, and they are cannot be called as buddhiman. Manushyeshu sa buddhiman sa yuktaha, yuktaha, what does Vashyav, I would like to see the gloss there, if I can see the gloss there, uh, I just said yogi, an easy way to see it, but let's see what Bhagavan Vashyakara says, sorry, not here, here. sa yuktaha, yeah, yogi, cha. so very nice, so it's yogi, so you, study bhashya you have get some ideas so all this comes from bhashya alone yukta once you see yukta you see yujhatu yogi comes to mind so uh, most of the times you land in the proximity although it may not be exact uh, sometimes sometimes you can go off track but uh, yukta is yogi yogi cha krishna karma krishna karma samasta karma krutya so samasta karma one who has done everything krita krutya ityartha iti stuyate karma karmano ho uh, <coughs> itara itara darshi, one who sees itara itara darshi, one who sees itara itara darshi means one who sees karma in a karma. Uh, the entire idea is put a one word, you know. Who is that yaha, yaha sa, karma karma no ho, itara itara darshi, one who sees karma as a karma, a karma as karma. That is itara itara darshi, one who sees the, exactly opposite to the worldly thinking. In one word, he has completed the entire bhashya on this, uh, at least on the first half. So that's the idea here. Uh, Krishna karma karma. karmani akarma darshanam stuyate. Now, this akarma, seeing akarma, first half, karmani akarma, that, that knowledge is praised. Darshanam is knowledge here. One who sees that, yaha janati. So akarma darshanam is akarma jnanam. Tadetat Karmani akarma jnanam stuyate chyartha. This is, he praises, Bhagavan praises by saying, Yasya sarve samarambha kama sankalpa varjitaha jnana agni dagda karmanam tamahu panditam budhaha. So, yasya sarve samarambha kama sankalpa varjitaha jnana agni dagda karmanam Jnanagni Dagda Karmanam Tam and Jnanagni Dagda Karmanam are in Samanadi Karnam Ahuhu They say Prathama Bhavachana Panditam Tam Panditam Ahuhu are this Te Budhaha Ahuhu So Budhaha Ahuhu This is the idea here Budhaha Ahuhu Budhaha means those who are intelligent Intelligent or Jnanis also They say Ahu, what do they say? They say that Yasya Sarve Samarambhaha Kama Sankalpa 
we can say varjitaha samarambaha samarambha are karmas so karmas although karma is uh, is neuter here it is said samarambhyat samarambhyate sarvani karmani samarambhyate samyak arambhyate arambhyate arabhyante arabhyante iti samarambhaha all karmas are very well executed begun means executed one taken undertaken all karmas are undertaken by undertaken very well by him all karma sarve yasya yasya sadakasya va vivekina ha va jnani na va samarambha ha all karma sarvani karmani samarambhyante samyak arambhyante and how are those samyak what is that samyak kama sankalpa yorjitaha varjitaha kama sankalpa varjita means he does not have anything to gain from that karma means there is no phalas phales pruha nasti ityartha kama kama is not there sankalpa is not there he does not say that i am going to achieve this kama is not there i want this result so varjita kama sankalpa uh, kama and sankalpa is dvandva tayoho varjita sashti tat purusha that kind of uh, samarambha that is the idea with samarambha kama sankalpa varjita yasya all karmas are like that not that one or two are like that and then others uh, are like worldly karmas no all so budaha tam yasya yasya tam ahu they call him as what buda tam budaha ahu what panditam ahu who they call him as panditam pandita he is a pandita not one panda asya sthiti pandita panda means jnanam shastra vishay jnanam is panda panda asti asti iti pandita so tam pandita mahu and what kind of pandita is he jnanagni dagda karmanam so this is a person jnanagni dagda karmanam pandita mahu hu tam tam and jnanagni dagda karmanam and panditam are in samanadi karanyam it is a karma to ahu hu they call him as pandita and jnanagni dagda karmanam so can someone tell me what is the pratipadika for jnanagni dagda karma karmanam so karmanam you see nakaranta nakaranta so jnanagni dagda karman Kar, so pratipadika i'll tell you tell me what is the first case singular jnanagni dagda karma karmanam is second case what is the first case pratipadika means jnanagni dagda karman because karma is the ending and here it is a person so it will become pullinga bahurihi jnanam eva agnihi so if you have to do samasa vigraha what will it be jnanam eva agnihi or jnanam agnim eva agni agnihi eva jnanam agnihi eva or jnanam eva agnihi karma dharaya and jnanagnina jnanagnina dagdham dagdham means burnt jnanagdida dagdham and here it will be bahuri so all this i can put in either i say this way or in bahuri i can say jnana jnanam jnanam eva agnihi tena jnanagnina dagdha so all will go in tritiya so jnanena jnanena agnina dagdham karma yasya saha so 33116 bahurihi or karma dharya then tritiya tat purusha and bahurihi <coughs> so jnana agnina dagdham karma yasya okay has anyone got the solution for this what is the first case think about this if you can't see it now karma yeah so good so it will be jnanagni dagda karma in pullinga tam au so yasya sarve kama sankalpa varjitaha samarambaha tam or we can say yasya sarve samarambaha samarambha whatever is begun is what kama sankalpa bhavanti we can add here bhavanti 
for a better anvaya. So its idea is clear. Samarambha are what? Karmani. Yasya sarve samyak arabhyante iti samarambha ha. Whatever pursuits are there, they are kama sankalpa varjitaha bhavanti tam budaha. Budaha tam budaha jnanagni dagdha karmanam panditam ahuhu. And this is the here tadetat karmani akarma darshanam stuyati. So you become an akarma darshi, then karmani akarma darshi if you become, then Buddhas will call you pandita. Jnanagni dagdha karma. Of course, just by knowing it, one will not become jnanagni dagdha karma. To become that, uh, quite a lot of effort is needed, but uh, Shravanamana Nidhyasana is there, needed, and that is only half of it. Therefore, Bhagavan Bhashyagara is tuyate. It is tu, it is a stuti, it is not uh, idamitham. Just by knowing it right now, you will not get it. You will, so they call you as Pandita, so thereby he is giving prerana for you to become an Akarma Darshi in karma. Okay, so we'll stop here. Any questions? Okay, no questions. I'll see you in the next part. Huh?